trouble for most of us. And for some today, it was a lot more trouble than just bundling up and warding off the cold. In Nally's, 40 families have been without heat for nearly 24 hours. And in Liverpool, nearly 30 people are homeless after a weather-related apartment fire. Well, that fire started because too much heat was applied to a problem caused by too much cold. Maintenance workers at the Village Highlands Apartments in Liverpool used a torch to thaw out frozen water pipes that accidentally triggered a major fire. More from Jerry Barsha. The fire broke out in the apartment next to the office. Flames shot through the roof and over firewalls between apartments. Lawyers Corners volunteer firemen aided by other units fought for over an hour before bringing the blaze under control. Yeah, up on a roof, we, we, uh, we got admitted so it went up in the air. We went down a few other apartments. The fire was in apartment two, it was my understanding. We went down apartments three, four, and five, pulled some walls, pulled some ceilings, and cut the fire off. The occupant of one of the apartments, William Davis, had just returned from a vacation. Just arrived in the house at 4.30 this morning, and then the, somebody starts smashing on the door. By the time we just grabbed our pants and come outside, the smoke was just pouring out of the eaves out of the building. Another resident forced out in the cold sharply criticized the management for not paying attention to a number of complaints from tenants. Management here stinks. I want to make it known. Management stinks. The guy came to fix the kitchen. He had to tear out all the walls. He came to fix it and he said he couldn't finish because I had all bare wires. This was Wednesday. Today's Monday. Nobody's been there to check my wires. Late today, fire officials said the blaze was caused by maintenance men using a torch to thaw out frozen water pipes. The Red Cross is in charge of finding temporary quarters for those people burned out of their apartments. Jerry Barsha, Channel 3 News. Well, I couldn't have... Oh, 